Hi, I am Dr. Kim Eckert. I am a psychologist at Roots Counseling Center and welcome to a new series that we are hosting that we are going to be having on our website and on our social media called Mental Health Moments. So in this series, we're going to just be sharing some short videos of, of work that we do in our offices. So it might be a breathing technique or a parenting strategy. Um, we might share some information from a therapeutic approach that we use or um, some info about the brain or about emotions, just something that can kind of offer a moment um, to pause in the middle of the week. Um, hopefully something that can add a resource for you. Um, this has been a tough year, unimaginable for so many, and we just wanna offer something that can provide some encouragement and support one of my favorite quotes is from Mr. Rogers, and he said many things, but one of his quotes is that feelings are both mentionable and manageable. And so in this series, we're going to try to do both of those. So the first is that feelings, all feelings and experiences are mentionable, which means that there's a kind of radical acceptance for whatever the reality of your world is, of your experience is. Um, these will not just be positive thinking videos, although that's really helpful, but an acknowledgement of the pain, um, of the stress, of the anxiety, of the trauma that, that, that you might be experiencing right now. So whatever you are experiencing is mentionable, and we want to acknowledge that here. But the second is that feelings are manageable and life experiences, that there is something to do, um, something practical. And so we want to offer some practical resources for ways to, um, walk through, walk with, and walk in whatever you find yourself um, dealing with or facing in this particular moment or season in your own lives. So for our first uh, video, I thought I would share a mindfulness and a breathing technique that we actually highlighted on our social media um, in the last few weeks. We, I led our staff in this uh, mindfulness meditation at our staff meeting a few weeks ago, and so I thought it'd be a fun and easy way to start. So this is called an hourglass meditation, or sometimes it's called a three-minute breath space. And this is from cognitive uh, mindfulness-based cognitive therapy. Um, and, and I'm going to tell you what we're going to do, but it, and it's, a, it's easy and simple, but it can be a really grounding and helpful technique. So you need three or four minutes to do this. So if you're watching this video, um, see if you can find a space to, to just center in and breathe. Um, so this, this follows the visual of an hourglass. So imagine at the top of the hourglass in the first minute, we're just going to bring awareness to whatever is here. So shifting, you might imagine shifting your focus from the out there, from whatever's going on around you, whatever you have next, whatever is on your schedule, to in here. So you're gonna bring awareness to your thoughts, to your feelings, to body sensations, really just kind of whatever shows up. And then in the second minute, imagine the narrowing of the hourglass. We're gonna bring attention directly to the breath. And so especially to the breath kind of in the belly or the gut as, a, as just a centering and grounding exercise and moment. So, so we'll just focus it on the breath. You don't have to change it, fix it, do anything. We're just going to follow the breath for a minute. Sometimes people, quite a bit, people will, will tell me like, I can't do mindfulness or I can't do breathing or I can't do meditation. My mind won't stay focused. And so this is a great first start because it's one minute. It's one minute. All you have to do, I mean, the whole exercise is three minutes, but that one minute of just focusing on your breath is one minute. So it's a great way to just practice and get comfortable with the idea of, of following your breath and doing a bit, a small bit of a mindfulness exercise that is actually really, really helpful. And then the bottom of the hourglass, so you've got the bringing awareness to whatever's here at the top, focusing it on the breath in the middle, and then the bottom of the hourglass is about expanding awareness back out. And so we're first going to expand awareness to the whole body. So kind of a head to toe body scan, and there's lots of good research on the benefits of holding your whole body in awareness um, and what that, what that does in terms of brain health, but then also bringing awareness of even as you kind of move in and kind of prepares you to move in to the next moments of your day. So that's what we're gonna do. It takes about three minutes, and so we will get started.
get in a comfortable position. You can close your eyes, it's great. Or you, if you don't wanna close your eyes, you can kind of fix a soft gaze on the floor. I'm gonna close my eyes um, and we'll get started. So the first minute, we're just going to notice what's here. And so notice any thoughts that you're having and notice them as thoughts. I'm having the thought, I don't know what to do or I've got stuff to do or this is stupid or I can't do this, whatever it is. Just noticing your thoughts, you're not changing them, you're not fighting with them, you're just noticing thoughts. Noticing any emotions or feelings and even name that to yourself like, oh, there's a feeling of sadness or jittery or worry. Any body sensations. So noticing if there's, if you feel some tension or discomfort somewhere in your body. Again, not trying to change it or fix it. We're just noticing. And then in the second minute, bringing that shifting into the middle of the hourglass. So for a minute, just focusing on the breath. So we're gonna breathe in and breathe out. And letting that breath be an anchor, grounding you in this particular moment right here, right now. So you're breathing in and you're breathing out. You don't have to do anything to your breath. You're just noticing it. Inhale and exhaling. And when your mind wanders or you start kind of going off in the um, other thoughts or feelings, you're just going to gently bring your attention back to the breath. You might even put a hand over your chest or a hand over your belly, just as that reminder. Breathing in and breathing out. And then for that final stage, we're going to expand awareness down. So now kind of going back and checking in with your whole body. So kind of scanning through your whole body, top to bottom, just noticing what's here again. And even maybe bringing particular attention if there's some places of discomfort, bringing your breath to that place. So maybe you've got some tightness in your neck. Just imagining and feeling your breath moving in and around that tension. We're not trying to get rid of it. We're just really making space for it. So noticing your whole body and then even bringing some awareness to kind of the edges of your body as we prepare to kind of move back out into the world. And this is a good time to open your eyes if you had your eyes closed or lift them up. Continuing to have that awareness of your whole body and a sense of moving in, moving into the next moment. So that is, I probably was a little longer than three minutes, but that is called a breath space or an hourglass meditation. So again, it's the top of the hourglass, just noticing thoughts, feelings, body sensations, middle of the hourglass, bringing attention to the breath, and then bottom of the hourglass, expanding awareness to the whole body and out into the next moment. So I hope that's helpful. And um, we will be back. I'll be back next week with another mental health moment. So until then, take care. Take care of yourselves and take care of each other.